What's up Trophy Hunter, welcome to my Platinum walkthrough for Die with Glory. The game is a puzzle adventure game and a pretty easy Platinum. So we're jumping right into it. You can skip the cutscene by pressing the cross button. Right at the beginning of the game, go left and pick up the axe. Now walk to the right and interact with the tree. Now cross the tree and climb up the rope. Try to avoid the tar by pressing left. So once you're up, go through some dialogue and we will see us in the next level. So now go through some dialogue again and then go to the right. Aren't we? <laughs> We're it's time to hack it and slash it. Do you want to hear the story of my fight with Joss the Red Knight? Yeah, he's standing right there. So this is basically the first level. Go through some dialogue and choose the first answer. I saved Joss from certain death and then choose nothing much in fact. And now choose start. This will start the first level. Now go right, stop at the bridge and blow your horn. Now move away from the bridge and wait. Now move left and jump down. Now move to the right and interact with the switch. Now go left and interact with the second switch. After you interact with the second switch, immediately run back to the right and interact with the bottle. Now just wait for the rock. So to unlock the next trophy we need to die 10 times from the lava, so move right and jump into the lava 10 times.
So once you unlock the trophy, go left and pick up the weapon. Keep going left till you meet the dragon. Now interact with the dragon twice. Now interact with the dragon again to talk with him. Now choose the second answer and you're done with the lever. Now press triangle to tell another story. This time choose the second one. I didn't help just there. And the second answer is nothing much, in fact. So me and Ragnar went to fight the Warren. So go right across the bridge and wait. Now jump down, use both levers and interact with the bottle. Now go left, pick up the sword, keep going left and interact with the dragon a total of 3 times. Choose the second answer again and you're done with the lever. Now go to the right to start another story. Choose the first answer, the story how I meet Joss again, and start the story. I was standing under the town gates. First pick up the mushroom to your left. Now go right to open the gate. As soon as it opens, run left. Now go into the castle. Go all the way up here and interact with the bell. Another important thing is when there are more actions available than one, you can choose between different ones with the right stick. So now it's important as soon as you interact with the bell, move right to 4 down. Now stand on the right side next to the beast and wait for the egg to unlock a trophy. Now go left and pick up the battery. 
Now move right, go up the stairs and interact with the mixer. You need to interact with the mixer a total of three times. Once you get the new item, go downstairs. Now go right into the building. Interact with the cage once. To go upstairs here, you need to be fast. So first leave the building and enter the building again. You have to wait till the night turns on the candle. It's possible that you have to re-enter the building a few times to trigger the next scene. If you enter the building and there is no light, run fast to the right and go upstairs. Now pick up the key in front of you. Now go left and jump down the building. Now enter the building again and interact with the cage. Now leave the building, pick up the sword and the rope. Now go right and interact with the wooden wedge. Now wait a bit till the knight jumps over the rope. Now interact with the rope again. Now wait for the knight when he falls off the horse, attack him with your sword. Now move right to trigger another dialogue. And now choose of course. Now press the triangle button to tell another story. Choose the second one, Shroomtown after Jaws death. And after that choose the first one, there was then we got along. I was standing under the town gates. So go to the left and jump up the plants. Interact with the switch. Now go upstairs and pick up the char. Now keep going upstairs and interact with the bell. If you missed the egg trophy, you can do it now. Now go downstairs. Now pick up the battery and interact with the switch two times. Mm. 
So now you have to control the second character. Go left and interact with yourself. Now go back into the portal. Now interact with the switch again. Now go to the right and interact with the gnome two times. Be careful you can die here, so once he is moving, keep going to the left and go up the stairs. Now go downstairs and interact with the bees. Now go to the right and talk with the bard. Choose the first option. Now go left and climb up the gutter. Now go right, pick up the strings, go right again and jump down. Now talk with the bard again. Choose the first answer, here they are. Now interact with the switch to your left. Now go right and leave the castle. Now enter the portal, go to the left and interact with yourself. Now go back into the portal. Now go right and interact with the knight. Now choose leave, interact with the knight again and select the char. Now go to the right, pick up the sword, interact with the knight again and try to fight with him. Now go to the right and press triangle to start another story. Choose the first one. Now's the time for the jungle story. You know, I've always wanted to see the distant exotic lands, to meet interesting people of ancient cultures. And we woke up in a strange and very hot place. So go to the right and interact with the egg two times. Now go right and talk with the wizard. Now talk with him again and choose the following options. First choose are you scared of my bravery? Now choose I'm just healthy and curious. Now choose also you have an axe in your stuff. 
And last but not least, I hope it's not cursed or something. Now go left up the stairs. Now interact with the rope to get to the other side. Pick up the carrot and walk into the tree. Jump down, pick up the leaves and now keep going right. Climb up the ladder, pick up the fishing rod. Now go left through the door and pick up the prat. Now interact with the third rope to open the other door. Now interact with the crow three times. Pick up the fish and the animal on the rope and climb down the ladder. Now go all the way back to the wizard. I personally picked up the feather, but you don't really need it, so you can ignore it. Go all the way to the left and interact with the can in the water. Now go right and upstairs. Now interact with the pot and use carrot, can and breed. And last but not least throw in the animal. After some dialogue you are done with the lever. So now go right press triangle and start another story. Haven't you heard how I got into the middle of the epic battle all over the skies? Well, here it is. So I found that giant flying ship. Go left, climb up the ladder and go on board. Now go into the cabin next to the old captain. Interact with the chest. Now go outside and talk with the captain. So now you have to talk with him again. Choose but your life is so interesting. Now choose and then what happened. Next one is and where was the key. And now how's that stupid. Now go down the ladder and left into the cabin. Now interact with the sculpture to get a key. Now go back outside, climb up the ladder. 
go into the cabin and interact with the chest. Go outside down the ladder. Go all the way to the right and enter the cabin. Pick up the chuck and leave the cabin. Go left and climb down the ladder right here. Go right, climb down the ladder, wait till the big animal passes you. Climb up the ladder, go right, pick up the fire extinguisher and use it on the animal. Now go left, climb down the ladder, go right and interact with the tap. So now go left, climb down the ladder, go right, pick up a cannonball and the cornflakes. And now go all the way to the left. Pick up the strange thing from the ground and after that talk with the two people. Now go all the way back where we picked up the fire extinguisher. Go right, pick up the milk and now interact with the pot. Now go left and climb up the ladder. Interact with the strange thing to your right. Now go left to the captain and talk with him. You have to interact with the captain twice. Once he leaves, go left, climb up the ladder and interact with the cannon. Now go down and go into the cabin where we found the key. Talk with the captain one more time. Now go all the way back where we picked up the cannonball and pick up the second one. Now go left and talk with the two people again. Now go right and climb up the first ladder. Now go right and interact with the barrel to get a wealth. Now go left down the ladder and left again. Use the wealth right here. Now go left and interact with the colored wealths in a specific order. Use it in this order, green, yellow, white, violet and blue. Now go right and interact with the red wealth. Go left, talk with the two people again. Now go all the way back up.
go right climb up the ladder and talk with the woman to fix the cannon. To load the cannon interact with it again. Now go left and talk with the man. Now go right and climb up the mast. Pick up the telescope and use it. Now go down and interact with this strange thing that is in the middle of the ship. Now go right and use the cannon. Go left and wait at the machine to bring up another shield. Now use the machine, go left and use the second cannon. Now go all the way down to the place where we picked up the wealth. Now go left and use the fire extinguisher on the fire. Now go back up. Go left up the stairs and fight the enemy. Go down the ladder, pick up the axe and fight the second enemy. So now we have only one more story, go right and press the triangle button to start the last story. Choose the second answer and after that the first answer.
So it was dark. Go right, pick up the bucket and the hammer. Now interact with the fountain. Go left and interact with the pliers. Now pick up the pliers. Now go left. Now interact with the wooden thing here to get a stone. Go left and pick up the candle holder. Now go all the way to the right and climb up the tower. Interact with the catapult three times. Now climb down the ladder and pick up some arrows. You need at least eight arrows to complete the lever. Once you picked up enough arrows, go left and interact with the chunks of ice. Place all the arrows and after that use the candle holder. So last but not least, pick up the sword and fight the enemy and you're done with the game. So guys that was my platinum walkthrough for Die With Glory, I hope this walkthrough could help you to get all the trophies and achievements. Thanks for the attention, see you in my next one. And then the stone giant. But apparently, before that there...